Well, new tonight at 10 horses, alcohol and thousands of spectators. Police in the city of South Fulton shut down an illegal rodeo and arrested the events organizers. So well, it happened Saturday afternoon on property off Butner Road and according to officers created noise and traffic times for miles. Well, Fox 5's Claire Sims is live in the city of South Fulton with how police found out about the event. Claire? Well, Deidre, this is where it all happened. Police say there were cars parked absolutely everywhere, both on this property and off. That led to massive traffic problems and lots of phone calls from frustrated drivers. It was horrible. Aurelia Hill lives just off Butner Road and says she was stuck in traffic for over an hour just trying to get home Saturday afternoon. This is video a neighbor shared with Fox 5 of the event officials say was at the center of the chaos. A rodeo and concert at Rancho El Paraiso with more than 2,000 attendees. My concern is that that area over there has become an event center. If you're going to rent it out as an event center, it needs to be coded for event centers. You need to be aware that you have residents who live over here who need to get home. They need to go to work. They need to do whatever. City of South Fulton Police say resident after resident called 911 to report noise and traffic from the ranch. And when officers responded, event organizers could not provide them with a valid permit for the event. Investigators say they also discovered they were selling alcohol illegally. Police shut down the event and arrested Jorge Maciel and Robert Figaro. Officers also confiscated nearly $60,000 in cash, proceeds from the unpermitted event. Police Chief Keith Meadows says permits are important so the city can ensure public safety. Absolutely. Because this event wasn't planned properly, we had almost nine police officers that we had to dedicate just to traffic control. Hill says she hopes the city will do more to keep problems like this from happening in the future because it wasn't fair to us. It wasn't fair to the people that came to the event. Now, police tell us there were some port points where they had to actually shut down the road completely to get cars in and out here along Butner Road, which of course contributed to the traffic nightmare. Now, we did try to reach out to the owners of this ranch, but we were not able to get in touch with them. We are live in the city of South Fulton, Claire Sims, Fox 5 News.